so guys in this video i'm going to show you how you can get unlimited neteller fund now i made a video some weeks ago where i talked about how you can get unlimited neteller fund and of course in that video i got the fund actually from a friend that contacted me from whatsapp that he has mastercard neteller fund okay and he's not able to use it and he wants me is asking if i can buy i said yes i can buy i got from him and i showed you three different ways by which you can actually you know get neteller fund at a very cheap rate okay so uh a lot of people have contacted me and said the video is not complete because i talk about how they can get uh neteller from from p2p how they can get to personal contacts whatsapp and you can actually go for and how you can do flyers okay this online flyers you put it on forums and then people can contact you to sell their mastercard funds to you and also on p2p through flyers through forums and then through personal contacts these are different ways by which you can get unlimited neteller fund but people are more interested in how they can get unlimited neteller fund fund through binance p2p and how do you go about it you set up hard okay you are going to have a usdt and you are going to sell your usdt for neteller fund now you now say how do i get my usdt if i'm getting my usdt at black market rate and i'm selling it back at black market rate how am i going to make profit Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you the secret here. And the secret is simple. We are buying a black market rate and we are selling a black market rate. But let me show you where the profit is. One USDT is not equivalent to one dollar Netella fund. Okay? One USDT is equivalent to like 1.5 USD Netella fund. What that means is if you are doing 200 dollar US 200 USDT, you'll be getting 300 dollar Netella fund. That's massive, okay? And that Netella fund, after taking all charges you want to take, and we can convert it back to Naira, and you are going to see the massive difference. Now, I'm going to show you practically how this is done. I'm going to set up an ad because this is exactly where a lot of people are having issues and they are thinking it's not gonna work. We'll be buying a black market rate, we'll be selling a black market rate. Don't worry, even the black market rate, when, when we are going to be selling, will be lesser than the price we'll be buying. But we don't really care about that. We, are, we care more because we are about the amount we are going to be getting our dollar fund on the Netella. Now, if you actually have Netella Mastercard fund and you go to P2P to sell it, you have already noticed that when you want to sell, you don't sell one USDT for one dollar. You sell one USDT for like one point two dollars, for like one point three dollars. <laughs> okay, even if it's Mastercard fund, they can increase this to two dollar per one USDT. You don't. Now, this is exactly where it comes in, and I'm going to fully show you how this actually works. Now, this video is long overdue. And a lot of people have actually asked me and i said today i'm going to make this video so very quickly i'll take you over to my phone and show you how this is done let me just mention to you that we have a telegram group and also a whatsapp group where we discuss about cryptocurrency arbitrage and how you can actually make money online and you don't want to miss it in fact we have over 11,000 members in our telegram group you don't want to miss it i have the link in the description for you to register do well to register uh, for you to actually join the telegram group do well to join the telegram group to get the latest update so i have a lot of messages on my whatsapp and contacting me through whatsapp might not actually be the right way to go and just remember i'm not ignoring anybody but just that i want to satisfy everybody and at the same time i also i'm also I, i'm also a human being i have 24 hours in a day and i have a lot of tasks to do so i'm not ignoring you just make sure if you have any any question you can ask on the telegram group and there are guys you know that are working selflessly to help people and i think that's massive also know that there are scammers on the group just in case you want to fall into the hand of one of them know that not everybody on the group actually came there in order to help or in order to scam people so take note of that so without wasting your time i will take you over to my phone and quickly show you how you can get netella fund very cheap and of course you can do this daily and make twenty-five thousand naira or more with this netella strategy i'm about to show you so without wasting your time i'm already on my phone and of course the first thing i want to do is to show you my netella account you can see i have 0.46 usd that means i don't have money in my net phone so i'm quickly going to buy usdt and i'm going to get net phone right here and i'm going to show you how you're gonna use it okay so i think that's beautiful okay so on net i have both naira account and usd account but you can see here somebody sold to me and i actually send it to do cash copy <coughs> now let me go to binance and on binance what i want to do very fast is i want to go and buy usdt okay but before i buy usdt I just want to show you one or two things uh, as to people that have been selling, people that already set up hard. Let us see how their hard is being set up. Let us see how much they are selling the phone and how we ourselves can tap into this. So uh, you can see if I come to my Binance now and I open it up just like I'm doing right now. <coughs> okay, so I just want you to load up and we are going to go to P2P straight up. Okay, so let it load fully. 
and you can see the position here and p2p trading so i'm going to click on p2p trading from the home page and that's going to take us to p2p and right here we want to buy us but actually we want to use usd we want to find netella phone people that are selling netella phone so we want to change currency from hngn to usd you can see my currency is now usd now in usd you can see we have a lot of uh, people that are selling usd but there are different options we have we have ada we have people that are selling atm okay we have people that are selling different options so we we'll click on filter i want to select netella so i need to click on the hold you can see hold button here under payment and i go and select netella because we want to use netella usd if it is euro you are looking for you change your currency to euro and you select netella now i don't want to buy from merchant only i want both merchant and non merchant to actually show so i hold the merchant and i click on yes now all the people we have here are only selling netella okay or netella with another one with netella or scurry or anyone so <clears throat> you can see the rate at which they are selling one usdt is not equivalent to one dollar one usdt on different people, different people said they are it now all these people are not accepting mastercard fund okay and they are still selling the rate as this high myself i will be accepting mastercard fund which is actually difficult for people to see people that accept mastercard fund and then i can increase or inflate my own price now see how much they are selling let's take for example this person is selling two dollar per one usdt this one is selling 1.5 dollar per one usdt what that means is that if you are selling 200 usdt you will be, okay like this 1.5 now if you sell it 100 usdt you will get 150 us dollar netella fund that's what it means <laughs> and you can see what that means so the process of converting from netella to back to naira is actually the main thing now clicking on this guy you can see this guy say not accept mastercard deposit and he put star star there so that you should take note of this accept visa card deposit accept gambling and non-gambling okay these are the two that you accepted and it must be visa card now he said he is not accepting mastercard fund and even though he's not accepting mastercard fund the rate he set is 1.29 guys 1.29 that rate is high but myself if i'm accepting mastercard fund and i set 1.3 okay so i'm going to get people because a lot of people have mastercard fund they don't know how to use it and they want to just sell it off on binance p2p i might even be the only merchant that is accepting a uh, netella fund so i want to convert back to naira and let me first of all buy usdt with naira okay so i click on usd that i have up here in order to convert it to naira so i want to select change my currency to the ngn and now i'm already okay i'm just waiting for it to load i'm on the naira page now on the naira p2p page because i will use naira to buy usdt 200 usdt is what i want to buy and then that usdt i will sell it with to netella fund okay i will sell it to netella fund now i'm on the buy page but it's not loading let me go to home page let me click on p2p again p2p trading okay so it has actually showed up and i want to buy of course i want to buy you anything with naira now i just need to filter because these people are selling 2000 to 2005 yes, 2000 and the rest i need to filter to see the real price so i want to buy uh that would be up to 100,000. so let me filter with uh, uh 100,000. let me filter with 100,000. i think that will be fine okay 100,000. and i click on bank transfer i click on only show out from merchant i want to buy from merchant okay I want to buy from merchant and i click on yes okay so this is beautiful and uh, we have the real price okay okay uh, you can see different people here but this is not actually what i wanted let me just uh let me buy from this guy here okay i buy from this guy here he's saying so i want to put one fifteen thousand let's see what's going to give us yes you can see two hundred dollars it's going to give us two hundred point one two usdt so i'll be buying right here this condition is a pay fast i release fast do not hide crypto release uh, related remarks so i'm going to buy from him i just need to click on buy with zero fee okay i'm paying one around fifteen thousand to him i'm getting 200.12 usdt you can see it's right here so order has been created and i have a message here say, i'm online and will release immediately i see payment no top party payment please don't pay from paper uh, pump pay it will be reversed please leave a nice feedback as i'll do the same so uh this is fine i just need to go and send one hundred and fifteen thousand naira to this guy to buy uh usd so i'll click on the, the payment page and right here i need to put i, I need to go and pay say pay the seller one hundred and fifteen thousand. you can see this is his name samuel aditola and then this is the account number here and the bank is using his palm pay okay so i quickly go to my hub now bank hub and go and sell send one hundred and fifteen thousand to his palm pay account and i'm going to copy this account number let me just copy this account number and go and make the payment fast okay so clicking on the copy button you can see right there okay copy successful now i want to go to my bank app and send it guys i've already sent one hundred fifteen thousand, as you can see 
to pam pay and to samuel Aditola. so i just need to go and click on transferred notify seller okay i've actually made the payment okay so binance is trying to reload uh let me just see okay so i have it here i just need to click on transferred notify seller okay so i click on that it's still showing me other created to payment page but it doesn't matter i've already clicked on it i can click on it again but i've clicked on it and i can actually trace to see you can see it's showing me the same thing if i click on transfer notify seller it's still showing me they said the operation is prohibited. okay no i'll just click on chat if i click on chat you will see that the okay you see you have marked the holder as paid and you can see the guy has also released the coin he has released the coin very fast this guy is very fast he does not even waste time at all okay and binance is telling me that p2p order has been marked as as uh, paid okay so i've received it and i just need to click on done so this order has been completed already okay so uh the guy actually did well i even need to i need to give him a positive feedback i, I think i need to give him a positive feedback so let me go back to the chart and i have it right here i want to give him a positive feedback right here let me just click on positive okay so he's very fast and doesn't waste time that's why i'm giving him that <laughs> so now i have 200 usdt let me go to my wallet let me just show you from my wallet i need to click on my wallet and uh let's go and see if you go to spot it's not going to show up in the spot because we bought from p2p okay so you can see uh, it's not there it's not there in the spot i have 2.7 dollar usdt but in under funding you see now we have 200.12 usdt available to me okay now if i want to set up hard now i will be setting up hard that i want to sell my usdt for Netella fund and this $200 will move from available to freeze. Okay, Binance is going to freeze it so that I won't touch it. Okay, so I want to go back to P2P and on the P2P here, what I'm going to do is I click on this three dot icon in order to go to advertisement page. You can see down here I have advertisement page. Okay, switch to advertisement mode. I'm going to click on confirm. And right now I'm on the advertisement page. As you can see, we have some options down here that shows that we're already on the advertisement page. So now we are on the advertisement page. And what I want to do first is I want to go to my profile in order to show you that um, what you need to know now in the last 30 days i've made 17 trades and completed i've 100 completion rate is what i have okay i've made 17 transactions in the last 30 days and the 100 completion rate your completion rate must be up to 80 percent and above before you can before you can set up ad hell you will not be able to set up ad okay and your total transaction since the time you register by now must be up to 20 transactions on the p2p so i click on hearts and i click on post hard okay so if you are doing it for the first time it's going to ask you to put in your username but this is not my first time so i already have a username now i want to buy usdt so i click on buy US, sorry i will be selling i want to sell usdt okay so i'm not buying i want to sell my usdt that i have for usd and the usd i will now select my mode of payment as netella okay so i'm selling usd usdt for usd okay sell usdt which is my asset for fiat usd you should get that option right now price se select uh, price settings is it fixed or floating i want fixed amount okay i don't want it to be floating as price is going up and down i just want a fixed amount this is the amount i want to sell this is the rate i want to sell not changing now if i select fixed now under fixed now what is the price i want to select now i want to set my own as 1.5 so if one usdt if i sell one usdt i want to sell my one usdt for 1.5 dollar because after all i'm the only one accepting a uh, master card for okay let me put 1.3 1.3 dollar okay so what that means is that each of my one usdt will give me 1.3 netella dollar okay i think that is fine i think that is fine if i put 1.5 i will get uh for 200 usdt i will get 300 dollars for 1.3 now i will get like 260 and this is exactly where the magic happens so i click on next now i say total amount now the minimum amount you can do here is 100 usdt and i have 200 so i click on all and now see the magic guys you say my 200.12 usdt when i finish selling it off it will give me 260 dollars this is exactly what i'm explaining to you i will get 260 us dollar in my netella account that's an extra 60 dollar and that is where the profit is even though i will still be selling it back at the black market rate but that is exactly where the magic is now what is the minimum amount i want to sell i want to sell 5 usd okay if you want to sell 5 usd netella phone to me i will buy anything less than that i don't buy i want to buy from 5 usd netella phone up until 200 netella phone now binance will also be taking their charges I will, I will show you that in a moment so let me just say 200 usd so if you want to buy 200 usd i can just sell it off to one single person and everything is sold off so it's now saying my payment method now i want to hard payment method so i click on hard payment method and right here saying bank transfer no i want to use all payment method and right here i want to start for netella okay you can see i have netella here netella i click on netella 
and then you say my name is already there i can't change it account number now this account number will put in my email address okay netella use email address not account number so i put in my email address which is my netella email address and i click on confirm okay so i click on confirm and that account will be set up okay so by now just want me to enter a code to be sure that i'm the one that actually added this payment method and not somebody trying to use my account so i copy that and i want to paste it right here and i click on submit so you can see successfully added so netella payment are now be added and they say you have successfully added a new payment method so i have it <coughs> so now i have now I have my payment method as netella okay i'm getting 260 dollar in my netella when i sold off all my 200 usdt okay now payment time limit i want to put it to 45 so in case i am not around or i didn't get the notification on time i still have enough room to actually adjust okay now reserve fee 0 0.70 usdt binance is charging me 70 cents or 0 0.7 usdt and if i click on that it's showing me that reserve fee for sell ad you will need to reserve a portion of the total advertised advertised amount for the processing fee and this actually goes to binance okay that's the amount they will charge me okay so i'll be left to 199 point something so i click on next and right here i need to input my terms and conditions okay so this is the one i set for my first ad i want to just clean all of this off i want to set up I want to give my own terms and conditions for this Netella fund. Okay, you can say okay, I accept Mastercard fund. You can say something like, uh, <coughs> let me just put it. I'll say I accept, uh, I accept Mastercard fund. Okay, so immediately someone see that they are ready to actually sell to me very fast. <laughs> so I accept Netella Mastercard fund. That's one of my conditions. Let me use a capital letter high. Okay, so I can set another condition apart from that and say something like uh let me just put uh let me see let me put um okay let me say pay from your own account okay it should be your own account don't pay from a third party account so your your binance account your binance name okay was match with your netella uh name okay i don't want the net uh, top party payment so let me just say your Binance name okay must be the same and uh, Netella name must be the same or something like that. So let me just I just put it there. Then you can also say okay when you make the transaction, I want to see the screenshots. It all depends on you, the terms and the condition you want to set uh for your, your funds for the person that is actually paying. So they have to actually obey that criteria and in order for them to actually use your service or else they will not be able to sell to you or if they sell to you we will give them terms that you don't accept that type of fund so it's better you just set your terms and condition i think i'm fine with this i'm going to copy this and of course i put it also in the auto reply so that should in case the person does not read my terms it's going to see my auto reply and it's going to actually see the terms okay so i say i release crypto fast okay i can say you do screenshot if you want to add it you can add it to you so i want to copy everything i have here i say select all and i want to copy i copy that I want to come down right here i want to click on select all and i want to paste okay so i release crypto fast so that is already done and then when you see the counterparty conditions you don't really have to do anything here okay if you actually select any options it's going to lower the number of people that see your heart so you don't need to select anything so i'm online already so i just put it to online if you don't want you to go online you just put it to offline now okay but i'm online now if you don't have usd in your binance uh in your, in your p2p account you can't do this you must have it first immediately i click on post the money will be freezed okay i click on post now the money will be freezed that 200 dollar will be freezed in my p2p wallet and i will not be able to use it for any other thing except for this particular transaction so successfully posted and if i want to see the details of this if i click on that you can see i've posted a fixed price of 1.3 dollar per one usdt my one usdt i'm selling for 1.3 net phone dollar and i'm accepting mastercard phone okay so um, the total amount that is left after Binance we take 0.70 USDT. I will be left 199.42. Okay, so minimum amount is five dollar and maximum is two hundred dollar. So you can see my remark and auto reply. I accept Master Netella Mastercard fund. Your Binance name and Netella must match. I release crypto fast. Okay, so that is set up and my account. My, this is already online. Okay, let me just go to the home page and go and show you that this is already online. Okay, it is online and anybody people can search for Netella fund and see my heart. So I want to select USD again, USD. Okay, so now I want to now filter with, I want to click on all and go and select Netella, okay? Just like we did initially. 
I select Netella right here and I click on um, yes okay so in uh, add from merchant alone I want you to show all okay both from merchant and from no merchant because I'm not a merchant so I want you to turn off only show ad from merchant and then let's now see what we have so I need to scroll down you can see these are different people these people are not accepting mastercard funds okay and they are selling at a fan lower right rate but let this just load up you will see my own hard you can see my hard here i have iron one two three and i'm saying 1.3 usd it's one usdt i'm selling for 1.3 usd okay and uh, take note of this even though i'm selling for this price i'm accepting mastercard phone so people will check from the beginning and say that nobody's accepting mastercard phone but these guys are accepting mastercard phone they will be more than happy to sell to me and it's a win-win situation for us they have the mastercard phone and their, their money is stopped okay it's stopped and then i'm accepting it from them and i'm giving them uh usdt which they can sell off on the p2p so it's a win-win situation for both of us and i'm gonna make my money now when i get the phone in my netella account what do i do there are two things i'll do i can go and sell it off on pages i might say this is a mastercard phone pages doesn't accept mastercard phone don't worry even as much as it is the money you as you receive from someone even though it's mastercard phone you can use it on pages and you can use it on lucas copy now let me go and show you that here is pages now let me say and i have the 260 dollar okay 260 dollar let me just quickly log in okay let me log in so that you can see what i'm talking about when you have the 260 dollar and you say okay this 260 dollar i want to actually use it to buy from pages let us see how much we'll be getting and let's see how much profit we'll be making despite all the charges that will come with it so i want to log in okay so let me quickly log in to pages and show you what i'm talking about then i click on continue and log in okay so uh that is loading already okay and right here i want to put in i want to select uh let, let you can see i've already logged in okay so instead of mgn i want to select um let it load i want to select netella okay you can see netella usd and euro i want to select us dollar okay if I actually buy euro, I will be selecting euro, but I'm using Netella USD. How much? 260. Okay. Let me put the 260 dollar and I have my Netella phone. After I've sold off the 200 USD, USDT for 260 dollar. Now I want to buy, let me buy uh, SLM. Okay. Let me just say I want to use it to buy SLM, for example, or USDT TRC20. Okay. Now, if I used to buy USDT TRC20, okay. How much is it worth in Binance? Because this is the exact amount that we receive in Binance. 238.6. My $260 will give me 238.6 USDT. Exactly in my Binance account. They have taken off all the charges. Now let me check another one. Let me check if I'm buying SLM or if I'm buying Tron or if I'm buying Stella. Let us see how much. Okay, this is Stella here. Okay, Ripples. Now Ripples is also $238.72. It's still the same thing with Tata USDT. So there's no point just uh, buying <coughs> SLM I have to go and convert it on Binance okay let me go let me select Stella and see Stella is also 238.72 just like USDT and just like Ripus okay and if I select Tron it's still going to be the same okay so let me select Tron as well okay to just see the difference if it's going to which one is going to give us the highest amount okay so Tron now you can see Tron even reduce it to 238.71 instead of 238.72 so let's just buy USDT so that we won't have to be converting and converting again. So USDT TRC20, I click on that and 238.72. Okay, we just buy USDT straight up. And 238.6 USDT we arrive in my Binance wallet after this transaction is done. All this baby transaction has been incorporated into this. So this is the exact amount 238.6 USDT is what I will receive in my Binance account. So let's go to Binance. I need to go and uh, go to P2P. I'm going to sell off this amount that we have 238.6 USDT. Let us see how much it's going to give us in Binance. Okay, you know how much we bought. We bought 115,000 naira. Okay, we bought with 115,000 naira. We got 200 USDT. Let's see how much we go and sell off on the Binance P2P. So, clicking on Binance now, of course, I will be let it load up. I'll be going straight to the P2P and go and sell off 238.6 USDT. And let us see how much we are going to be getting. Okay, I'm just refreshing for it to fully load. Okay, so I need to click on P2P trading. And right here, let's say I want to sell. Of course, I'm not buying. I want to sell my USDT after it has arrived in Binance. Okay, so now I need to filter. Uh, that amount should be around 100,000 plus. Okay, so I want to filter 100,000 bank transfer. Okay, so I want to show her from merchant. I want to sell to merchant. 
and I'm going to click on yes okay so I click on yes and now the price is 570 per one dollar remember we bought at 550 574 okay but we are selling at 570 no problem so now I'm selling to this first guy and he has his condition but we don't really care now if I say 238.6 you see it's going to give a 136 thousand one forty one hundred and thirty six thousand one forty but remember we bought at one fifteen one hundred and fifteen thousand naira exactly and it's giving us one thirty six thousand one hundred and forty naira so let us do the let's do the subtraction let's do the subtraction now i'm going to make another netella video after this where i'm going to do this practically okay where i'm going to actually buy and i'm going to sell i will load my netella card with net uh with mastercard fund and you will see how you can how you can sell it off so it's going to know this and then we'll make a profit of twenty one thousand one forty guys Twenty-one thousand one hundred and forty on just two hundred dollars. Sorry, two hundred USDT. If it were to be one thousand USDT, you know how much that would be. That would be times five of this, and that would be over hundred thousand naira. Okay, so uh, let me say another one is we can sell it to Lucas Copy. In fact, Lucas Copy is going to give us more profit than what PBS is giving us. Okay, now if you have Lucas Copy and you have their virtual card, now if you don't have the virtual card, you can do bank transfer, but their charges on bank transfer is high. So if you have the Lucas Copy and you have their virtual card. Okay, you are going to make more profit when you use your Netella phone with two cards copy than when you use with PBS. So I want to use my fingerprint, and of course, uh, let me just allow you to load. Okay, so now uh, I don't have any money right there. You can see that up. So I want to buy. So I need to click on the bank bot. Okay, so I want to click on the bank bot so that we can go and deposit. Okay, and then you see the charges. They will charge me. I will quickly do that, and then I will round up this video because the video is already getting long okay so clicking on bank button i want to say load money deposit and i want to use netella even though screen is also available i want to use netella and then it's processing up and okay uh it's loading it's loading it's loading okay so we're saying what is the amount and what currency do i want to select for my netella fund you can see my netella image is already there so let's say i have 260 which currency i want to select usd and then it will tell me the fee i will pay guys i will present 7.84 dollar 7.84 dollar now if the amount is 100 dollar will charge me less than less than 3 dollar but because it's 260 that's why they are charging me 7.84 dollar now and i will pay a total fee of 267 but remember i have 260 so i need to reduce this amount let me reduce it to like 253 let's see how much i'll be paying i'll pay 260.63 now i don't have the 63 let me reduce it to 252 Okay, so I'll pay 259.6 and I remember I have 260 in my net alarm phone. Okay, so this is fine. So I'll be I'll be sent I'll be getting 252 dollar in my Ducas copy after paying 7.60 fee to Ducas copy for using net alarm phone. I will have 252 dollar in my Ducas copy. Okay, if I make this transaction, if I click on proceed now, it will take me to net I will input my password and then I will send the money right to Ducas copy and I will get. 252 us dollar the next thing i will do after getting the us dollar is i will convert it to euro because for me to use my virtual card on, on binance i need to only, i can only deposit with uh, euro so let me go to google and convert this to euro let's see how much is 252 dollar to euro okay that's uh, google rates and that's the salary that uh, lucas copy is also going to give us 252 dollar to euro okay i need to convert to euro before i can spend it on binance so let me just click any one of these. We have to fifty-two dollar to euro. Convert to fifty-two dollar to euro. Let me just select. Let me just click on the start button. Okay, it's going to give me two hundred twenty-three euro. Two hundred twenty-three euro. So I will convert my two hundred fifty-two dollar to two hundred twenty-three euro on Ducas Copy, and then I will use that Ducas Copy virtual card on Binance. Okay, but now if I want to use my virtual card, whether Mastercard or Visa card, on Binance, Binance is going to charge me one point eight percent. 1.8 percent okay so let's do 1.8 percent that's 1.8 divided by 100 1.8 percent of two of uh the amount we got now is uh 223 euro okay 223 euro that's four euro that's 223 euro i'll pay four euro so if i remove four euro from 223 euro how much is left so 223 minus four euro 223 minus four euro which is 1.8 fee that Binance is going to charge me. I'm left with 219 euro. Okay. Now 219 euro will appear in my Binance Spot wallet. Now let's go to Binance. I quickly go and do this. Let's say I have 219 euro in my Binance Spot wallet. 
and I want to convert it to USDT. Okay, let me go back from here. Let me go to my uh to okay. I need to click on trade and right here I want you to select I want to search for euro euro USDT. Okay, so euro slash USDT. You can see the first one here. I click on it. Okay, so now let's say I want to sell my euro. I click on sell and I have 219 euro. See what I will get. I will get 247 USDT. 247 USDT. We arrive in my Binance Spot wallet. I will transfer it to P2P and I will go and sell it off. Now, 247 USDT. Let me go to P2P. I'm going to see. I want to sell. Okay. And let me search. Let me filter with 100,000. Just like we did. Initially, 100,000. Okay. So, I have a bank transfer. I want to buy from merchants. Sell to merchants. And uh, let me buy from the first guy here. So, remember 247 USDT. Okay. He said the other refresh. Let me just refresh this again. Okay. So, to the first guy here, let me just click on sell. And uh, right here, I want to sell 247 USDT. See, I'll get 140,930. 140,930. You see that Ducat's copy is giving us more than what uh, PBS will give us. Now, let me do the calculation. Now, 140,930 minus, remember when we bought the 200 USDT, then we pay 115,000 naira to buy 200 USDT. 115,000. See, just a pro we made a profit of 25,930, which is almost 26,000 naira. We made a profit of 26,000 naira on 200 USDT with Netela Fund. Okay, so the profit we actually made came from the extra 60 dollar that is on top of our USDT. So one USDT is not equal to one dollar. One USDT is actually more valuable than dollar when you are selling Netela or Skiri Fund. This same process can be used. For Skiri, so it's not only Netella because both of them are almost the same. Or let me say they are the same. So we just made a profit of twenty-five dollar, which is twenty-six dollar. If I'm doing it for one thousand dollar in a day, that's one twenty-nine thousand six fifty. That's around one thirty thousand dollar every day. If you can sell one thousand, if you can get one thousand USD and you are selling at one point three uh, dollar per USDT. So this is exactly how it is done. I know this video is long overdue. It's a very long video, but it's very educative. I'll make another video on how you can actually load. Netella with your MasterCard phone, and now you can use that MasterCard phone in order to buy and do arbitrage, and you can still make profit with it. So, on this note, I'll be closing and saying to you, see you in my next video, and bye for now.